James here, and today we're taking a look at this very cool little kick scooter. This is from Wayplus, guys. This is actually for kids and adults, anywhere from six and up. It does have big eight inch wheels, and it is in aqua in color. The cool thing is, guys, this is fully just a kick scooter, all right? There's no electric to this. Now, it is fully adjustable all the way up to, I believe it's like 38 inches of height, which is actually very good. Uh, can hold the person up to 240 pounds. We're going to test that theory. I'm a little more than that. We're going to see if it can hold me in a while. Uh, guys, on here, you got these nice aqua blue wheels with uh, polyurethane outer edges on these wheels, which is actually cool. Now, it does come with a whole bunch of tools. The tools are so you can actually break it down, put it together, and all that cool stuff, or store it away. It does come with a manual and a strap. The strap is actually cool because it lets you help carry this and strap it together when you don't want it to. Now, it does fold. There is this red little button right here, so if you push this button right here, it folds down in. Of course, guys, gotta be careful. Don't scratch your counters up like I just did. Uh, my wife is now gonna probably send me down the road. But when you fold it up, guys, it's not gonna sit correctly or properly. It's gonna wanna tip over because it's got a kickstand. This little kickstand stops it from just sitting flat, so you do have to lay it down on its side, unfortunately. I would have loved it to have been able to go down. Now, you do have this C-channel frame, uh, full, uh, full aluminum frame, guys, C-channel style. Now, you will have nuts and screws everywhere on this. Now, I'm going to bring this closer to you so you can see the actual grip tape. Their logos way plus everywhere. Um, now, the one thing I did not mention is, is this actually has a suspension right here. So, you do have a little bit of absorption uh, for riding. Now this is a hard wheel, it's not a soft wheel, so it is a hard wheel ride, so you're not going to have air in there, so don't worry about that. Now pop it back up, push that button, clicks into place, and you're back up and going. Set it down, and you're good. Now, adjusting this handlebars, guys, literally push this button, you can slide it down, just like that, and you're all the way down. Now if you want to come back up, again, press it, and come back up. You can also then adjust this. To pop it up and out if you need to break it out. Very simple, guys. It comes apart easy. Now, the handlebars. These are cool. I'm going to actually change views to show you guys the handlebar workings uh, because the handlebars do come apart so you can actually put them away and store it away easier. So, guys, give me a second. Let me change views. Okay, guys. Now that I changed views, you'll see this. Now, you can actually pop this flip or this lever up, right, like that. There are these push pins. The push pins come out, the handlebars come down, and they have these little connector pieces, just like this, guys, for storage. So they do come apart, and you can put them away so it flattens out even farther for storage. Uh, putting it back together, simple, just like that, guys. You'll put it in, you'll clip it, push the pin in. Once the pin's in, you will then adjust this down. On the other side of this is an Allen screw right here. These Allen screws right here, guys, you can tighten them to make sure they're extra tight. Now, the next thing is, guys, I'm just going to take it out. You're not going to hear nothing else from me from the rest of the video. I'm going to ride this, and you guys be the judge of the rest. I want to thank you for this, and keep your eyes out on the rest of this little video. <laughs>